Amber Heard countersue Johnny Depp. Punitive damages awarded. Who is the biggest loser in this legal battle, you won't believe the latest twist in the Hollywood drama that's captivated the world. The Johnny Depp and Amber Heard trial was a roller coaster of emotions, accusations, and shocking revelations. But the verdict set shockwaves through the industry. Information in this video is based on reports from US Magazine. Johnny Depp walked away with a hefty $15 million in damages, while Amber Heard was awarded a comparatively smaller $2 million. Today, we're diving deep into the fallout, analyzing who truly lost the most in this high-stakes legal battle. Let's break down what led to this explosive verdict. Amber Heard's op-ed ignited a firestorm, painting Depp as a domestic abuser. Depp countered with a defamation lawsuit, claiming the article ruined his reputation. The trial became a media circus, with every twist and turn dissected by millions. The jury's decision was clear, Amber Heard's claims were largely unfounded. However, it's important to note that the verdict doesn't erase the complexities of domestic violence. Both Depp and Heard suffered immensely, and the trial undoubtedly took a toll on their mental health. On one hand, Johnny Depp, the once beloved Captain Jack Sparrow, seemingly emerged victorious, with a jury ruling in his favor. This win was a major boost to his reputation after years of allegations. However, the road to recovery won't be easy. His career took a significant hit during the trial, with major roles being cut or replaced. Despite the financial gain, the stains of the trial might linger, affecting future projects and collaborations. Now, let's talk about Amber Heard, once a rising star, faced a career downturn. While the $2 million award might seem like a win, the overall impact on her career is devastating. Her role in the highly anticipated Aquaman sequel was drastically reduced. And her public image took a severe blow. It's clear that this trial has significantly damaged her career prospects. But is she the ultimate loser? Some argue that by speaking out, she ignited a conversation about domestic violence, empowering countless victims. On the surface, it seems like Amber Heard, with the massive damages awarded to Depp. Her career has undoubtedly taken a hit, and public opinion has turned against her. But is it fair to label her the sole loser, the financial aspect is also crucial. While Depp received a substantial sum, legal fees and the overall cost of the trial likely ate into a significant portion of that. For Heard, the $2 million might not be enough to offset the legal expenses and the damage to her earning potential. We'll analyze the financial implications, the impact on their careers, and the broader societal effects of this case. Did the verdict truly deliver justice, or was it a battle with no real winners? And her public image took a severe blow. It's clear that this trial has significantly damaged her career prospects. But is she the ultimate loser? Some argue that by speaking out, she ignited a conversation about domestic violence, empowering countless victims. On the surface, it seems like Amber Heard, with the massive damages awarded to Depp. Her career has undoubtedly taken a hit, and public opinion has turned against her. But is it fair to label her the sole loser, the financial aspect is also crucial. While Depp received a substantial sum, legal fees and the overall cost of the trial likely ate into a significant portion of that. For Heard, the $2 million might not be enough to offset the legal expenses and the damage to her earning potential, we'll analyze the financial implications the impact on their careers, and the broader societal effects of this case. Did the verdict truly deliver justice, or was it a battle with no real winners? And her public image took a severe blow. It's clear that this trial has significantly damaged her career prospects. But is she the ultimate loser? Some argue that by speaking out, she ignited a conversation about domestic violence, empowering countless victims. On the surface, it seems like Amber Heard, with the massive damages awarded to Depp. Her career has undoubtedly taken a hit, and public opinion has turned against her. But is it fair to label her the sole loser, the financial aspect is also crucial. 
While Depp received a substantial sum, legal fees, and the overall cost of the trial likely ate into a significant portion of that. For Heard, the $2 million might not be enough to offset the legal expenses and the damage to her earning potential. We'll analyze the financial implications, the impact on their careers, and the broader societal effects of this case. Did the verdict truly deliver justice, or was it a battle with no real winners? Beyond the financial implications, there's a broader impact on the entertainment industry. This trial has sparked a much-needed conversation about domestic violence, consent, and the power dynamics in Hollywood relationships. It's a stark reminder of the challenges faced by victims who come forward, and the immense pressure they endure, social media played a massive role in shaping public opinion during the trial. Both Depp and Heard were subjected to intense online harassment, highlighting the dangers of cancel culture and the importance of critical thinking when consuming information online. So, who truly lost the most in the Depp Heard trial? While Depp might have won the legal battle, the war for public opinion is far from over. Heard's career has undoubtedly suffered a major setback. Ultimately, both actors have paid a heavy price for this public spectacle. The Depp Heard trial was more than just a celebrity feud, it was a reflection of our society's complex relationship with fame, power, and justice. While the legal battle may be over, the conversation is far from finished. The Depp Heard trial is a stark reminder that even the most famous are not immune to the complexities of human relationships. It's a cautionary tale about the power of language and the impact it can have on lives. What are your thoughts on the verdict? Do you think justice was served? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay updated on the latest celebrity news. And remember, every story has multiple sides. Let's continue the conversation respectfully.